Wait, so I got another video for you guys. I have an issue with this Jeep. It's nothing to do with the Jeep itself. This is stupid lock nut. I bought the Jeep, didn't come with the key. I got the rear ones off already. What I'm doing is taking a wrench, sticking it on there, welding all the way around with my little cheap welder. It's an awesome welder from Princess Auto. But today I am trying to weld off my 3000 watt Chinese inverter and LiPo batteries. So we are going to run. We are almost fully charged in the batteries. 65.7 volts, 125 volts coming out of the unit. And we will be welding on battery power. And you guys will see it from the GoPro. Hope you guys enjoy this. Hopefully it works. It will. We'll find out soon. All right, here we go. Let's see if we can get this done. When I do it the first tack, I don't look at it when I weld. And I just uh, uh, look away as I do my first tack. done. Everything seems to be working fine off the inverter, which is awesome. So I will be able to take this to the field. Fairly late unit. I'm out. There, I got my wire rod.
tightening the wrench. <laughs> that worked. Got it off. Big pain in the butt. Took two guys. And one guy hitting it with a hammer, one guy uh, prying it, and we got it off. So now we're going to get this one off the exact, almost the exact same way. This time we're going to try uh, a nut. Battery voltage did not go down much. So this time we're going to weld a nut on. I don't know which one we're going to use. It might be this one. I'm going to try welding on the inside, tack welding around on the outside, but we'll see. Thanks for watching. Well, that was a giant success. Inverter, top is tiny bit warm, barely warm at all. Inverter did amazing. So, this side is done. Rim did sustain some damage. So I've now decided, that's this focus, I've now decided I am painting these rims all the way around. Same with this side. This side sustained a lot more damage because I've tried this nut first. As you can see, I couldn't weld it properly because the angles and so what happened was all this got destroyed. Like the rim is just looks like shit. It's gonna have to be sanded down and repainted. So I'm gonna paint the rims. I don't know when exactly I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Another thing I recommend is the Power Fist uh, MIG welder from Princess Auto. This thing is amazing. It's only about 120 bucks, something like that. That's awesome. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.